I show you how to put more songs on a CD. If you don't like the 80 minutes on the CD, I'll show you how to put more than 80 minutes on a CD. First, go to if you first you need a CD burner. If you don't have one, you must buy an external one or use your other computer that has a CD drive. Go to Windows Media Player and then click burn. Before you burn, click the drop down menu which has like a little window with settings in it. It has a drop down menu that says data disk and audio CD choose data disk and go and drag your songs it must be mp3 format because if you try different file formats it won't work it must be mp3 so Try it on a computer that has a CD drive and then drag your songs onto that CD and then you click burn and then it burn your CD and then it writes all the files to the CD and then you could get another CD and then burn that as well. So, you don't spend like 20 CDs, rather than, you could save CDs and money by using data CD functions for music. So, if you're like a whole collection of songs, which you don't want so many CDs in your collection. So, this is going to be a good thing. I'll give you two. Or I'll give you a little music. I guess I'm on my current propaganda. I'm not gonna show you the whole two minutes of it, which I don't have to. Sometimes you get songs off, or your songs are not listed. If you have a rewritable disc. There's no problem if you have one of these type of CDs, which doesn't allow you to um, rewrite them. Uh, turn that down. If you have a CD that doesn't write rewrite it, that means it only uses one time only, and you can't delete it. These CDs are not best for you, so. Use the rewritable CDs because it's a lot easier to write data and Alright, that's enough of this stuff. Sorry, get the case open. Uh, that's for our Stormer CDs. Let's put this CD, this CD, and this CD. I'm putting the blank one in here. Probably I'm gonna burn something. So there's my CD. It's going in here. It's going in this case. So I'm putting in the little cable, the cradle thingy. So it came all CD safe. 
It's fresh. I kill my CDs fresh in here. So, that's inside the DVD player. That's it.